Hello, my lovely people. You are welcome back to my channel. Hmm. My people, oh, Kasala Dombos. Kasala Dombos, oh, Wahala Day for Palace. Anyway, Sha, you are welcome back to my channel. I greet you according to your time and according to the time you are seeing this video. How are you doing? I hope you are good. We are still on the juice from the Palace of Oni of Ife, my correct people. Yes, so my correct people last week they hear alleged information say uh, anti uh, Ebony that that time they said they brought in that strange artifact and they started accusing her saying that she was the one that brought it in but she was not the one so she was not happy and when she went to find out who actually brought in that thing we heard allegedly that they told her that she should they they did not tell her that look at the person that brought it or not or the other person. What we heard was that they told her that she should go and make peace with Queen Naomi. <clears throat> when she come to investigate on another thing, they started telling her something or something different. So she said that she had been going but actually have not uh, Queen Naomi have not been giving her uh, attention. My color people. That she will go again. <clears throat> you know, say Queen Nomi this time around, not to give chance to anybody. Queen Nomi is a spiritual human being. And she has principles. That is one thing I know about her. She doesn't want any trouble. And you don't give her trouble. She doesn't want any go slow. So, my color people, they said allegedly. That after they said that she should go and beg Queen Nomi to forgive her and so many things, although we heard that she, she was using a, is it her spiritual priestess something to uh, invoke the king? I don't know, allegedly, that is what I heard. So when she wanted to go and uh, pre, uh, pl uh, plead with Queen Naomi, because she said that she had been going. Even when even when we heard that she was coming back from UK, she stopped at uh, Leki. Kunomi did not give her any at attention. Kunomi did not give her even check any attention. And there was like, she was disgraced that day. And all she was doing, she's trying to do is to uh, make peace with Naomi. But I want to say this before I proceed. For that, for priestess to make peace, peace with Naomi. Is it going to stop her from being priestess? As in because she she wants to be closer to Queen Naomi. And again, eh? Why Queen Naomi is not accepting her right now? Maybe because she betrayed Queen Naomi. Or is it because she's a priestess? What about that time she was in the palace? Was she not doing the priestess work? When she was in good time with uh, Queen Naomi? Serving Quinomi food and drink when she was putting family planning pills. Was she not doing the priestess work? Because if she had been doing the priestess work and still serving Quinomi food, it means that <laughs> I don't know what to say, Sha. It's not supposed to be. Okay, that is by the way. Now, what we are hearing is that she went to Akure to see Queen Naomi. On her way, Quinomi had been in upstairs and saw her. But they said that when Kunemi saw her, Kunemi saw, though Kunemi is in spirit then, Kunemi saw some, uh, like, one person possessing maybe two persons at the same time. Like one, one body now, having two different bodies. Like, the thing was like, this one is about to leave. You know how they used to act it in film? That one spirit want to leave, the other one want to possess. The other, the thing was doing wah 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 wah, and the king and Kunomi was like, hey, Kunomi called the mother, or all of you to go inside, go inside. Nobody should go and receive her this time. Uh, she want to go and use her hand to receive her. You know, when she come now, she will be at the gate. The driver will stop. She will knock at the gate for someone to come and welcome her. My career people. What are we here, you know? We heard that. <coughs> Excuse me. She went to Kunomi went to the gate to get to fetch her. 
On could me going there, could me have been kabashing, praying. You may have been speaking in tongue, praying inside of her, kabashing, you know, that kind of a thing. When you see a strange spirit, because that thing is a strange spirit, she was coming with one different spirit possessing her. And the spirit was like, maybe doing as if it is, as for the person that have spiritual eyes, oh. So, you know, when, when somebody that is in spirit, somebody that have spiritual eyes, sees a, a extraordinary something, you know, they need to, they used to recognize. Because when she saw uh, Auntie Ebony, she, when she was coming, she saw her with different, different, as in like a spirit trying to move out of her, coming in, moving in, just doing like this, uh, left and right. And she was seeing that thing. That was why she said that her mother and brother and sister and Tade should go inside. She went to receive her. Immediately, she went to receive her on, at the gate. She had been praying and she started kabashing, started praying. My correct people, they said that uh, Auntie Ebony started doing, oh, oh, oh. You know when you are doing deliverance? When you are doing someone deliverance? Oh, her economy was kabashing, praying, praying. Oh, oh. That is what they said she was doing. You know, at this Stage, she fell on the ground and was rolling and was rolling. Mama Tade Niko will continue to pray. No, be smart, you know, allegedly. Don't forget that they are all alleged because me, I was not there when these things were happening. As I hear, I share with you. She, Mama Tade was praying. She was rolling on the floor, on the ground. She was rolling. I know that she dressed very well. She was rolling, rolling, troubling, uh, troubling herself on the ground. Rolling, rolling. Hey, they say that after some times she stopped uh, rolling. Like maybe the spirit left her immediately. So when the spirit left her, she now gained herself and stood up. Okay, Kunemi helped her and she stood up. When she stood up and she was like, ah, she said that she was looking at herself as if uh, she knew that something was wrong. And she, uh, she, Kunemi ordered them to bring a chair. She sat down. She stayed there for some time, so she don't even know again what she have come to say in the pala in in Akure. She forgot what she has come to say, and small time she demanded that she want to go. She want to go back to the pala that she will now call Queen Naomi on phone. My people, when I heard this one, I was like, "Is this true? Is this true? You know, say na 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 gossip with the carrier on this time around. Confirm." But is one, one thing about this our uh, rumor and the alleged information is that some of them used to be true, but we will tell you for sure that we are not there when it happened. So it's left for some people to go in and investigate and tell us if it is actually true because this one shocked me. Oh, it shocked me. Anyway, I don't forget that they are all alleged. Me, I was not there at the Palace of Elefe Kingdom. If you have not subscribed to this channel, please subscribe. If you are a subscriber, thank you. My God will bless you. Love you guys. Bye.